so in this circular path tutorial basically I want to uh, get some input from the other process and I want to execute it right so for the iteration and the maximum loop I am not going to assign any value right so I'm going to define the value take the value from the other process so that's the difference right so as I told you I'm going to get the input from the other process so that's nothing but the start right so let me add a value here I'll just add number we will just add it and iteration right so as you can see we'll be storing that in iteration and then the max loop right max loop uh, number and max loop right so that's done and after that I want to pass the value of the iteration to the main process right so so that's why I'm going to the end and creating right and that's a number and I am passing it back to the iteration okay it's done so you can see here I provided the input and then I'm sending the output as well and then just save it right it's done and let me just close and go back to so just connect this thing this done right now once you open this particular process you will see CR right so CR that's the process where I made the changes um, you can see here it's asking for two things if you remember this is the thing that I passed earlier right so I can pass my input to the main process from this thing right so let's just give the values 1 uh, and 5 right and the output um, the iteration value we would like to store it right in uh, here so just created a variable and just assigning done right then um, just uh, run it see how it goes so as you can see here yeah uh, it's done so you can see here I got the value 5 here right so um, I iterated for 5 and then return 5 right then um, yeah you just see here when I call this particular process yeah uh, one minute so let's say if you want to debug it like looks fine but if you want to debug it just add uh, breakpoint create uh, breakpoint and run it that's the most easiest way to debug it and once you iterate it then it takes you to a particular uh, process right as you can see here it's iterating for uh, five times and then it's done right so uh, when you and and it it takes you to the main process so that's that's the uh, example of the uh, circular path right how you can iterate the whole process and that stuff 